This is the preferred shot on an Impala by most hunters. When the Impala presents a broadside stance, the optimal point of aim is the shoulder region. Specifically, you should focus on the slightly rear-shaded portion of the shoulder. This point of impact should be selected at a height that is approximately one-third of the total height of the Impala's body. A frontal shot placement on an Impala is a demanding and intricate task that requires exceptional precision. This involves targeting the area just above the brisket where the neck meets the body. While a well-placed shot can swiftly and humanely incapacitate the animal by severing blood vessels and damaging vital organs, the presence of dense bone structures requires careful accuracy to prevent deflection of the projectile. This is not a recommended shot. The Impala stands as one of Africa's most prevalent and elegant antelopes. With a sleek and nimble physique, it effortlessly overcomes challenging obstacles and reaches speeds surpassing 37 miles per hour, 60 kilometers per hour. Its fleet-footed nature enables leaps of up to 32 feet, 10 meters, in length and 10 feet, 3 meters, in height. This remarkable agility serves both predator evasion and seemingly sheer enjoyment. A male impala, known as a ram, exhibits distinctive lyre-shaped and ringed horns, extending up to 29 inches 75 centimeters. These horns take years to fully develop, explaining why young impalas struggle to establish dominance and breeding territories. Females, called ewes, lack horns. A male impala releases a scent from a forehead gland to signal his status to rivals, a decline in scent production accompanies a loss in rank. During the mating season, males engage in battles for status and territory, deploying their antlers as potent weaponry.